Hi friends, Radhika Ravi Kumar here. So in this tutorial, we'll see what is SQL tracing. So we all know how the explain plan will work, and already have created a tutorial on explain plan. So based on the same concept, the SQL tracing also will work. See, um, the SQL tracing, uh, we know very well that uh, this execution plan, uh, so the explain plan, uh, is used mainly for the SQL statement in order to uh, know like how much um, CPU consumption is happening whenever we execute the statement SQL statement will be using the explain plan there is this SQL tracing will be used for both um, SQL and as well as uh, PL SQL uh, programs okay so this tracing will uh, generate the execution plan execution plan and as well as and uh, some CPU statistics once after the execution so what exactly happens is in explain plan um, the actual query when we say explain plan for and we give the query and then we display the explain plan they actually the query will not get executed whereas it will just show uh, like how much uh, cpu in case if you run the run execute that uh, particular query how much cpu consumption will happen and other statistics and all will be shown but in this sql um, tracing actually the sql uh, queries and as well as the uh, pl sql programs will get executed okay and then the plan is uh, given to us okay plan is given plan and a uh, plan execution plan as well as some cpu statistics so um, another thing to note in this sql tracing is whenever after uh, uh, creating this sql tracing the output file um, that is the tracing file will be stored at the OS level that is it will be stored where we have uh, installed the Oracle so the file will be stored at the OS level and uh, this file is called as the trace file and by using this trace file only will be uh, we can make out like what exactly is the uh, performance of the programs that we have run okay so this trace file that is uh, it will be in the um, dot trc extension okay so this will be in uh, it won't be in uh, readable format that is uh, we can say it's a non uh, readable format so once uh, after the you know uh, taking up the plan we need to go to this os level and get this dot uh, trc the latest dot trc uh, file which will be in a non readable format and we need to convert it into the readable format so in order to uh, you know convert this readable uh, format you should be using an uh, something called uh, the os uh, level utility utility that is uh, called as uh, tk prof okay this tk prof is nothing but it's um, transient kernel profile okay so this is the uh, full form of tk prof so you should be using this tk prof in order to convert this non readable dot trc file into a readable file that is you can convert it to something like a dot txt file we'll see how we can do that so this tk prof is an os level utility which converts a non readable format of the file into a readable text format so this is what is about uh, SQL tracing, like the brief explanation. So in the next tutorial, we'll see how we can, uh, you know, run these um, uh, PL SQL program as well as SQL program and take up a plan and see like uh, what is the exact performance of the programs that we have run. Uh, so then uh, we'll we'll see in the next tutorial. Then uh, hope uh, you have understood uh, what is the what is the SQL tracing and uh, as well as we will take up uh, the difference between SQL tracing and explain plan also in the further tutorials. Hope uh, you have enjoyed my tutorial. Thank you very much for watching.